Want to increase your production without overcomplicating the process? Whether you are a beginner or a pro, the Leonardo Design Studio's Tile Array feature is a quick and easy way to maximize your output while saving both material and time. Let's take a closer look at how by using two coordinating designs. To start, open your design using File, Import. Choose Cut Only and Apply. Once open, locate the Artboard Navigation window on the right side of the screen. Here, we want to make sure that the Artboard dimensions match the amount of material we have available to cut. Since this design is relatively small, we can fit multiple copies on a 12 by 12 sheet of material and can utilize the default settings here. For larger designs, simply adjust the size of the artboard using the media width and length fields to match. From here, let's turn our attention to the bottom navigation bar. Find and hover over the scale icon. While hovering, you'll notice two groups of icons. The first group covers ways to rotate. The second, duplication. From the duplication group, choose the middle icon that says tile array and looks like four squares. Within the pop-up window, you can adjust the number of repeated designs using the quantity arrows manually or simply click the auto fit button. Since we have already sized our artboard to match the available material, the auto fit button triggers Leonardo to fill a space instantly for you. Need or want to eliminate space between repeats within the rows or columns? Adjust using the arrow keys here. The overall area of your now repeated file can be seen quickly here. You can also choose to include grid lines here and turn the live preview of your design on and off here. When you're ready, click apply and your design is ready to send. Since we have another design to go along with this one, let's open another tab and continue our setup process. Simply click the plus icon at the top and repeat the same setup process as before. You'll notice that we have two colors in this design. Because of this, we can choose to set up our file in a couple of different ways. First, we'll repeat just as we did before by setting up our artboard size, navigating to the tile array tool, and clicking the auto fit button. Just like earlier, we can continue to fine tune the spacing manually as desired. If we hit apply and send design, you'll notice that one of our layers has a little more space between the repeats than is really needed. Strap for time, Simply continue by sending to your cutter and you'll be ready to go in no time. Want to fine tune a little more and get more out of your material? Head back to the design space and follow a couple of quick steps. Here, we'll undo or delete the copies we just made, ungroup the elements, and separate them. Repeat the same steps as before to each piece. You can now separate these copies onto their own layer for easy navigation by selecting and clicking the plus button in the layers panel like this. For the smaller piece, you can now see that we can fit six copies instead of four. However, there's still a little more space that could be utilized. By rotating at 90 degrees using the rotate tool, we can fully optimize the space available. Once fully optimized, click Send Design. If both layers do not appear in the cutting window like this, head back to the design space and double check that all layers are within the artboard. Load the material into your cutter, send your design, and you're ready for production. To learn more about this and other features available, check out our other tutorial videos that can be found on YouTube and within the Leonardo Tutorial tab.